What's going on y'all? It's finally August 20th and as you guys can probably tell, I'll be uploading every single Monday, Wednesday, and Friday every single week. If this video seems a little bit rushed, I apologize because I'm actually starting sophomore year tomorrow morning. I'm excited but at the same time a little nervous because I still have been running all over the place. I'm still running all over the place trying to finish these 35 page chemistry packets, read library books, and read English books. Y you know how that is, right? Okay, I'm gonna stop rambling. So in today's video, I'm gonna show you guys how to do the Roy Kramer saturation fade effect. This effect is gonna be coming from his Hawaii video, which he uploaded about like five or six months ago. Uh, yeah, that's a long time, but it's a really cool effect. So I'm so excited to show you guys how to do this effect. And without further ado, we're gonna be using Adobe Premiere Pro. So yeah, let's hop into the editing program. Okay, so yo, what's going on YouTube? It's Matthew, and you're probably wondering why I am not in the editing program right now. That's because my software corrupted, but basically, uh, this is the next day. I've already had my first day of school. By the way, it was pretty good, but we can talk more about that at the end of the video. Or but yeah, uh, let's hop into the editing program now and show you guys how to do this effect. Once you are in the editing program, whatever you use, if it's Adobe Premiere Pro, Final Cut Pro X, even Avid, please don't use Avid, it is a nightmare. I used it in New York and I'm never ever using that again. Okay, well anyways, once you're in your editing program, you want to make your clip. I'm using a drone shot and the reason that this clip is good is because you can see that the sky is very colored in this clip. You want to choose a pretty saturated clip with lots of contrast in it, so pretty saturated, contrast, got it, bada bing, bada boom, we're good to go. Okay, so yeah, this is my clip. I think it's pretty good, pretty good color in the sky, beautiful sunset, God's creation, pretty amazing, am I right? But uh, yeah, that's our clip. So once you have your clip on the timeline, as you can see, this is the timeline, I have my clip here. What we're gonna do is go to the effects tab. I'm gonna search up Lumetri Color. Okay, so we're gonna take that Lumetri Color under the Color Correction tab, and we're actually gonna drag it onto the footage. After you do that, nothing's happening yet. We're about to get to that part, and it's about to get really cool really fast. If you go to your effect controls and you scroll down, you will see creative curves and basic correction. We're gonna hit the drop down on creative, go to the bottom and you'll see saturation. Basically what you wanna do is drag this little playhead to the beginning of your clip up here. We're gonna hit this little stopwatch looking thing. It's called a keyframe or a toggle animation icon. We're gonna hit that and then we're also going to move this playhead up here to the end of the clip. Backspace once on your keyboard to go back one keyframe. And then we're just gonna type in zero for that saturation and as you can see, we have the effect. This is basically the effect that we are working with. Pretty cool effect. And also, if you want to do it the other way, you can also do that. I'll show you how to do that in a sec. All you want to do is switch these two keyframes and boom, black and white all the way to your saturated clip, slowly, slowly progressing and boom, you got that beautiful sky sunset and yeah, it looks awesome. There's so many ways that you can use this effect, and I know it's a very simple effect, but it is actually very dramatic for your storytelling if you have great visuals paired with it. But yeah, I know this was like a super short video, super uh, rushed video also at the same time. But without further ado, I hope you guys enjoyed this little short tutorial. Maybe we should do like two minute Tuesdays like Peter McKinnon does or something. I don't know, maybe three minute Thursdays. I, I put it down in the comments if you want me to do any of that stuff. I will see you guys on Wednesday with a brand new video every single Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and if you did, be sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel. I will see y'all in the next video on Wednesday. I hope you guys have a great rest of your day, and yeah, I've been Matthew. You guys have been awesome. I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.